Okay, so just a quick video here to show people how to set up um, Visual Studio to reference the NXT libraries for the robot. So I'm in Blackboard and I'm just going to our week 7 lecture and I'm going to grab that uh, that NXT library zip file. So I'm clicking on NXT libraries. So I'm going to save it um, save it somewhere that is a location that you're always going to um, going to reference it from. Okay, so I'm going to put it um, I'm going to save it on the D drive. Okay, so save. I'm going to go to the D drive. And once it's downloaded, I'm going to unzip it. So you have to unzip it. Um, before you can associate it with your program. Okay, so now it's ready. I'm going to right click and I'm going to say extract to NXT libraries with or without robot because I want it to all be in one folder. Okay, and actually it already had a folder, so let's um, let's just cut this from here. Cut. And put it up one level just so we don't have to browse down two levels. Okay, so here I've got it with all its inside files and it's on the D drive. Okay, so I go back to my program. I click on the actual project name which is here. Don't click on the CPP file. Click on don't click on the solution. Click on the project and go to project properties. Step and then click on this little con arrow beside configuration properties click on C++, you want the general tab. You're going to go to additional include directories. You're going to make a new folder and you're going to browse to where the include folder is. So that was on D include. So don't click into that folder, just highlight it so that it's selected here and say select folder. And then say OK. OK, then I go into linker, I click on general, I click on additional library directories, edit, and now I'm going to browse to the bin win32 folder. So I go to my folder bin win32 and I select that folder and I see it there and I say OK. Then I go to input and I go up here to additional dependencies. I edit this. I don't have to browse to anything. I just type nxt plus 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 lowercase d dot lib and I click OK. Then I say OK. 
and then any program that we run with the robot should be okay. So if I grab this robot example code, and I'm just going to copy all of this. Okay. Control C. I can put that in here. Control V. And let me just try to build this. Ooh, actually I don't want to build this until I change this because I don't have a robot right now. <laughs> 